MacArthur lays a spiritual legacy. Prayer for his son. April 6, 1964. The New York Times. Washington, April 5th, AP. General of the Army, Douglas MacArthur, is a leaving a spiritual legacy to his son, Arthur. A father's prayer that wrote in the Philippines during the desperate early days of the Pacific War. According to the general's biographer and confident Major General Courtney Whitney, the family repeated this MacArthur prayer many times during early morning devotions. Build me a song, O Lord will be strong enough to know when he's awake and brave enough to face himself when he's afraid when he will be proud and unbending in honest defeat and humble and gentle in victory build him a son whose wishes will not take the place of thee the son will know thee, and then to know himself is the foundation stone of knowledge. Lead him, I pray, not in the past years and comfort, but under the stress of spur difficulties and challenge. Here, let him learn to stand up in the storm. Here, let him learn. Compassion for those who fail. Build me a son whose heart will be clear, whose goal will be high. A son who will master himself before he seeks to master other men. One who will reach into the future and never forget the past. And after all these things, he is, and I pray enough of a sense of humor so that he may always be serious and never take himself too seriously. Give him humility so that he may always remember the simplicity of true greatness, the open mind of true wisdom and the meekness of true strength. Then I, his father, would dare to whisper, I have not lived in vain.